It's so very important to understand how your mental health can impact your finances or vice versa, how your finances can impact your mental health. Cherry Dale is a financial coach with the Virginia Credit Union. She says, if you're having a lot of anxiety around your finances, take a step back and really analyze your spending habits. Write down where every dollar goes. And while you are tracking, she says, take note of how you are feeling when you see where your money is going. If we are depressed or sad, we might go into an avoidant behavior when it comes to our finances. And that's actually the worst thing you can do because if we avoid what is going on, it generally just becomes worse. She says tracking your spending will also help you realize any patterns. Do you go shopping when you feel depressed? Is that a coping mechanism? But it makes you spend more than you want. The way we were raised and any traumatic experiences we might have had it as a child or growing up can Im impact the way we view money, the way we value things. And if you can start connecting those dots for yourself, you're starting to give yourself more power and more control over your finances. Dale says if you're feeling a little bit out of control and worried about your mental health, an important first step is to recognize the signs and seek counseling. But the same goes for your financial health. There are financial coaches out there, some are even free, that can help you learn your spending habits and patterns when it comes to money and your mental health. With this Watching Your Wallet, I'm Rachel DePampa.